if you think your child has a chronic condition or you think your child has a special health care need, it's important to start now. So you need to start asking questions uh, to understand what, what services does your child need and to try to exactly figure out what the issue might be. The earlier that many interventions start, the more effective they are and the more helpful they can be in the long term to help support optimal health for your child. Uh, it's not too late. So we know that the, the first years of a child's life are critical to build a solid foundation for learning, uh, but it's never too late. So it's, it's always, um, or it's never too late to seek services and start getting help because everything can help. Es muy importante cuando usted tiene un niño con discapacidades que empiece lo más pronto posible a buscar lo que se necesita para su hijo. Lo más pronto posible que empiece usted a buscar los recursos, la información, el apoyo emocional, lo más mejor es para usted y para su hijo. If you have an inkling or a feeling, a gut feeling, trust your gut feeling if you think there's something wrong, because chances are you're right. If you're afraid to speak with your physician or your physical therapist or whoever about it, don't be afraid. Don't be afraid to look foolish. Time is of the essence. So you may be afraid or you may be in denial that your child has a special health care need or might have a chronic condition, but it's important to seek help. It's important to ask questions. It's important to figure out what's going on with your child so your child can get the right services that they need. I always reassure families it's not a waste of my time. That's my job is to un to listen to what what they what concerns they have, answer their questions, and help make sure that everything with the child is okay. I cannot tell you how critical ages zero to three, zero to five are. The brain is still growing, and while the brain is still growing, you want to do everything you can to help that brain grow in new ways. You want to challenge those nerves to do new and different things because it is possible to overcome many difficulties during this critical time of brain development. You have to realize that every day is a battle sometimes more so than others. Sometimes it's, you feel like it's you and your child against the world. And you as a parent, you are a warrior. You're a warrior for your child. Slow and steady wins the race. An acute illness you get over in three weeks. Chronic is defined as something lasting more than three months, whether it's a disability or an illness. This is a marathon race. And so you need to think in terms of slow and steady wins the race.